if x is equal 4 to power of 4, which of the following expressions equals 4 to power of 15? a. 128x squared b. 64x cubed c. 32x to power of 4 d. 128x to power of 4 At this moment I encourage you to pause the video and solve it by yourself. Ok, I will solve it slowly now. Um, we could calculate each of those expressions a, b, c and d, but this would be a little complicated and time-consuming. It is easier to start from 4 to power of 15. So 4 to power of 15 and I'm thinking, okay, I see x squared, x cubed, x to power of 4. My x, I know, is x is 4 to power of 4 here. Uh, so, so, what would be x squared? x squared would be 4 to power of 4 squared. And we know power rule, when it's power to power, 4 to power of 4 to power of 2, we multiply powers. So that is, of course, 4 to power of 8. OK, what would be x cubed? x cubed would be 4 to power of 4 to power of 3. We multiply powers when it's power to the power. So it's 4 to power of 12. What about x to power of 4? x is 4 to power of 4 and then to power of 4 because x has to be to power of 4. That would be 4 to power of 16. In my expression here, I have just x to uh, 4 to power of 15. So, the highest power of x will be probably x to power of 12 here. Because we have x to power of 4, we would need x to power, uh, 4 to power of 16. OK, so I will continue with that 4 to power of 15. Maybe I will erase that and write again. 4 to the power of 15. This will be equal. I know now from this I can use 4 to power of 12. So this will be 4 to power of 12 times 4 to power of what? That's product rule. When we multiply expressions with the same base, we add exponents. So 12 plus what is 15 plus 3. Then 4 to power of 12, I'm going to use still this moment. I will change 4 to power of 12. I will write it 4 to power of 4 to the power of 3. That's 4 to power of 12 times 4 to power of 3. Then 4 to power of 4 is x. I will replace this times like by x. This will be x to power of 3 times What's 4 to power of 3? 4 times 4 is 16. 16 times 4, 4 times 4 times 4. 16 times 4, 64. So x cubed times 64, I'll write it as 64x cubed. Question is done. So my answer for this question will be B. B is the answer. I am planning to create more useful videos so do not forget to like and subscribe.